Hi everyone, this is Marcy with Digital Dynamo here, and today I'm going to show you how to modify your Avada theme for WordPress so that you have a transparent header, while also have a menu that can be legible in a different color on your homepage versus your subpages. Okay, so as you can see, we're on the Digital Dynamo website, and I have a transparent header going on. And on the home page, the main navigation, the font color is a white color. But if I navigate to the sub pages, it's a dark color. And the reason for that is white, you couldn't read on this colored background. But dark, you couldn't read on this colored background. So what we need to do is we need to modify it with custom CSS so that your home page and only your home page has a different colored font for its main navigation. Okay, so we are going to work with my staging website as I show you how to do this. And one reason why this is a little more difficult than it may look on the outset is because we need to make sure that the font not only looks correct with a transparent header, but we need to make sure it looks good in sticky form if we're using a sticky header. And we need to make sure it looks good when we resize the browser. So, to do this, what we'll do is we're gonna to go to theme options. We're gonna to go to header. We're gonna to go to header styling. And we're gonna to go to header background color. And right here, we have this opacity all the way up. We wanna make it totally transparent by moving this bar down all the way down so that the transparency is zero. So now I'm going to save changes. And if we go back to the home page, we hit a refresh. The background is now transparent for our header. But we can see these menu items they're too dark, it's really hard to read them. We wanna make them a lighter color. And we also wanna make sure that the sticky background header, since we're gonna use a white background, we wanna make sure that this stays this color. And we wanna make sure when we resize our browser and we end up with a hamburger menu, that these menu items also stay dark. Okay, so to do this, I'm going to go to my WordPress dashboard and I'm gonna go into the home page. I'm gonna click on this custom CSS button and I'm gonna add in some custom CSS. So I've already written out the CSS I wanna use and I will include this in the blog post so you can easily grab it. Go down a couple lines and paste it in. So now here is the custom CSS that's going to help me achieve what I want to achieve from here to here. So what this CSS is doing is changing the color of the menu text and that little drop down indicator. It's making it so that the hover color is the color that I want it to be. Same with the little indicator but it's also making it so that when it's in sticky form, the color of the menu is that dark gray color. Same with the drop down indicator in sticky form. And lastly, when my browser is resized to a smaller width, making that hamburger menu come up, the menu text is also a darker color. Okay, I'm gonna hit update. Go to the home page, hit a refresh, and here we see the font color of the main navigation is white. If I hover over it, it's got this orangey color. If I scroll down, we have my sticky menu, but its menu items are a gray color. 
checks in with the indicator right here. And then if we go to a sub page, the menu items are dark and they will stay that way. Okay, I hope this video helped you out.